welcome back to my YouTube channel. We're going to talk some bodybuilding here, okay? So, I'm pulled up right now at a gym in Burnsville, Minnesota. It's called Iron Alliance. They are hosting, not at the gym, but they're like one of the sponsors of the show that I'm doing in July. If you were the first 100 people to sign up, like moi, I literally did it for the freebie. You get a free backpack. I'm about to go in and get the backpack. They're like a bodybuilding backpack you'll know when I show you um, but they're not like it's not a backpack I would choose but it's for the for the vibes okay but I am gonna have it be my gym bag I want to do a couple errands I want to maybe get a couple like pre-workout or supplements or something to like put in my bag and it just excites me for prep keeps me on my shit I've been following my macros pretty much to a T I'm not quite on my prep macros but I'm very very close to them because I'm going to Hawaii at the end of March and we want to get it right, get it tight, okay? Um, but we're going to go in. We're going to get the backpack. Keelan and I are going to go shoot some content at Lowe's tonight. Let's let's do it all. I also need to get gas, but here we are at Iron Alliance. It is a rainy day out in February, which is freaking wild for Minnesota. All right, guys, are you ready to see? It's honestly bigger than I thought it would be. She big. Okay, so you can put patches on here. You'll see a lot of, like... IFBB pros who put patches on their bag. I don't know. Should I keep the flag? I probably will get different patches for up here. She big. She gonna be a good gym bag. I'm actually hyped because this is a really nice, like high quality bag. I'm not really much of a camo girl, but this bag literally has like 507 pockets. There's this backpack brand called Wolfpack, and that's, I don't know if that is a Wolfpack branded backpack. I don't know if I can tell somewhere on here. You can buy patches on Wolfpack. I know that faux show. You guys, these leggings I'm wearing are Viore leggings, and they're really cute, but um, they make me chafe like a mofo. Okay, sister, are we going to load here, or? All right, next stop gas station i also want to see if they have a vitamin shop around here because vitamin shop has different stuff than gnc so i want to see what's up there um but yeah first i need to find a gas station do you ever just feel like some days more than others people are just driving like freaking wackadoodles i like am so annoyed by people right now i'm like scared to go into target because if there's any shenanigans. Now get me the frick out of here. The first two things going in the bag. Prep staples, baby. I'm putting them in the top little pocket. Um, and I also got me an Ollie Pop because I'm a good girl and I deserve it. The grape olipop is incredible. All right, I'm going to go home. Oh, good. My camera needs to charge. I got Alex a suitcase for, I was about to say Christmas, Valentine's Day, because we're going to Hawaii at the end of March. Like I said, he doesn't have a suitcase, so I thought it would be a good Valentine's gift. I also got him a little gift just because for tonight, which I will show you when I get home. All right, guys, here is... Alex's little gifty all just little things he's like that he likes um I had to go to Target anyways obviously so thought I would think of him and pick some stuff up <laughs> hi guys sorry for the pause in the vlog but basically nothing went to plan yesterday um we went to Lowe's to shoot some content it was way, 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 way too busy there. Like, you couldn't even have worked out there if you wanted to. So, also while I'm thinking about it, we're going to put a little deodorant on. So, if you need a reminder to put deodorant on, here it is. Um, but what I wanted to show you is the box behind me. So, we've had a complete, oh, it's kind of heavy, complete rebrand of the classes at Lifetime. So, it's now called Class Collection. Um, we have some balloons for a balloon arch. We also have some branded balloons. Find your energy. I think these are sweatbands. These are kind of cute. Um, 
class collection balloons that say LT and then class collection on them. We got some little stickers that say class collection on them with the new lifetime logo. Some stickies to put up this wall of tiles that has all of the new brands on them. We have, what just fell Oh, that was my phone. Let's pop open one of these sweatbands. Bracelet to like wipe your sweat. Okay, well, we'll take it. What else do we have in here? We have some note cards. I like to write note cards to um, members and my team. So these just say class collection on them. And then on the back, they also say class collection and they have all the brands going across on the bottom. We got a little gift um, for leaders, a classes collective um, water bottle. I'm gonna probably give these to my team that helps me. And then we also have these little sweat buddies and different like um, things for people. I tried something new and then new strength unlocked. So that's everything that's in here. Anyways, there's all that. That's cute and exciting. I am about to do stair stepper. I need to make my little concoction in here. I think I'm just literally going to do grape Kool-Aid because I have, um, I need to put my ground beef in the fridge, but I just have this little Kool-Aid guy that I like to add to my water. I'll probably put creatine in it. Kool-Aid and creatine, baby. All right, guys, I currently am home. I just showered. I changed. Allie's having a birthday party tonight. Just a couple of close friends. We have to wear pink for it, so that's why I'm wearing my pink sweatsuit, not that I need to justify it because it's not really that out of the ordinary for me to wear. I came home, showered. I gotta go back to work. We have this bar training thing tonight at the club that I need to show up for just the beginning of. Um, and then off to Allie's and yeah. It's been a long week. Why do I feel like I say this every single week? You know where you're like, you need change in your life and you're just not where you want to be and blah 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 that's how i feel right now like i love my job but i'm fucking drained so that's my little rant for today i love the nespresso okay hello because it makes it hot but not like too hot this didn't fit well this was and it is an espresso shot didn't fit in my cup i mix a little protein water cinnamon to make a little creamer Good morning, guys. I taught classes, as you saw some little snips of that. I'm home, Alex cleaned, and I'm about to make breakfast. We'll show you what I'm making for breakfast. I'm gonna do some egg whites, an egg, some ground beef, and then put it all in. A tortilla. Got my counter um, macro-friendly tortillas. They're so good. I They have like a really nice texture to them when you warm them up. So we're doing that and then I'm going to put one serving of reduced fat Mexican cheese and I'm gonna melt it on the tortilla. Do you wanna know how my day is going? There you go. Yeah. All right, here she is in all her glory. Hopefully eating will help me feel a little better. But yeah, gonna dive in. It's a Christmas miracle. Little Timmy wished for a fixed camera. Yeah, Those okay. TikTok sounds were right. Yeah, <laughs> your lucky one. My mental health might be spiraling, but at least my camera fixed itself. Okay, we're going to this place. Whoops, I can't see myself, but I hope I'm there. Um, called Queenie and Pearl, where you can make your own like Valentine's like shirt, or they have baby tees, which I was like, oh, that's gonna be cute. Oh, you too. I was like, wait, did you step in poop? That's literally what I thought. Do you know what Jan would say? What? That's good luck. Stepping in poop? Yep. He Is it good luck to get pooped on? Yes. So, so just change your attitude about it if it happens. <laughs>
Okay, so the back of Keelan's sweatshirt looks like this. We had to do a little um, impromptu photo shoot for a giveaway that turned out better than planned, honestly. Yeah. And now we are rewarding ourselves by shopping even more. We are going to Free People Movement and also maybe Paper Source. So, yeah. All right, girly pops, it's leg day. We're having a little pre-workout fuel and some legitimate fuel too, some gorilla mines, because our mines are gorillas. Um, and yeah, back at our old stomping grounds. Mm -hmm. All right, we started with RDLs on the Lady Killer. It's not what it's actually called, it's called the hack squat, but call it the Lady Killer. Single leg hip thrust. Now we're gonna do this upright hamstring curl and a standing calf raise. Because I can't lay down to do hamstring curls yet, so either it's like the like opposite of a leg extension sitting up or this one. What do you have to say today? That's had an awesome day. You did? Mm -hmm. What made it awesome seeing me? Real relaxing. But you're a part of that. Hey! Thea just almost took my snack. Two, four, six, seven. Okay, she didn't take any. Here's my little post-workout snack. I'm actually gonna also have yogurt, but I'm gonna have this for, for first because I have really not eaten today. Um, flackers and a chomp stick. And I'm also gonna get a sparkling water and I might add a can to it if we still have cans. Are you excited for Billy? And for dessert, lunch dessert, yogurt, Frozen blueberries, granola, and almond butter. My favorite. Makeup is done for tonight. Ooh, I didn't look at it in different light. It looks good. Um, obviously, I still need a lip, and I still need to do my hair. I'm making a little coffee right now because girly is, you know, I hit that grandma time of the night, you know, 5.30, and I'm like, okay, good night. So I just put a little bit of um, sugar-free sweetener in it. It's a shot of espresso. And what I'm gonna do is add a little bit of non-fat milk and then some ice and cheers. I'm gonna do my hair, I'm gonna put my outfit on, get a lip on, and we'll meet again. I'm having a chomps because I'm hungry, but here's the look. I'll show you full body, or at least I'll post a full body photo, but I have these boots on. And this dress is basically a midi dress from Princess Polly. Cheers. Oh. All right, guys, home from dinner. I'm making us protein pancakes for dessert. In my hack to make it go a little bit further, you add it to your Kodiak cakes mix, is sweet lupin flour from Puris and pea protein powder from Puris. Um, I'm also adding egg whites. Alex already made some protein pancakes earlier. They had a mix leftover that he put in the fridge. Ooh. And now here we are. But yeah, we had a good dinner. Thing we like to add. Um, Keelan took a really cute picture of me in my dress, so I will Ooh. insert that here. Editor, if you could please do that for me. Keelan and I each had a dirty martini at dinner. That's kind of my new thing, guys. If I do drink, um, just because you literally have one and it's yummy and um, it's not super sweet, you know? That way men get old fashions. Uh, men get old fashions because it's a manly beverage. And I feel like the girls that get old fashions are like the girls that are like, I love beer. Well, I don't know. I don't like beer, so personally I'm not the like beer girly that would be also be like, I want an old fashioned, cause I, love beer. I don't, I know you do. Surprisingly, I skate up for the whole Super Bowl. I spray tan Keelan um, and her and I narrated the whole part that we watched. Um, in layman's terms, pretty much. But, according to Ben, I'm gonna get up early tomorrow and meal prep. I've been keeling to the airport, but if 
I'm feeling it, I'll get up early enough to do some cardio. Good morning and happy Valentine's Day, you guys. Okay, I'm actually gonna put you a little bit lower. And here we are. All right, this is the V-Day fit. I have a pink little bandeau. I have a, a brown bolero. I'm wearing brown um, wide leg leggings and then pink shoes. Obviously, I have a pink bow. Um, I teach at 6.30 a.m. It is 5.40 right now. I'm about to bring the girls outside. I have a full ass bag of candy for classes today. I also have um, like three Tupperwares of protein balls because I made them last night to bring to my classes. Lots of instructors are bringing like their own treats, but I also provided um, treats for everyone. So I love Valentine's Day. It's literally my favorite holiday of the year. I'm going to a, a little Valentine's event at Four Seasons tonight. Um, and then I'm taking Noah's Valentine's Day spin class. I teach 6.30 a.m. and 11.45 a.m. So all the classes, all the things, all the Valentines, all the love songs, that's the tea. That is the tea. I'm gonna make like three outfit changes today because after I teach, I'm gonna do my cardio. And then after my cardio, I'm gonna change. I don't know what into, whether, will I change back into this outfit? Maybe, maybe not. I have another pair of leggings, a shirt, a bra, a sweatshirt, a zip up. I don't know. I just wanted to have options, okay? So let's get this Valentine's Day show on the road. I'm gonna bring the girls out um, and then we're gonna reconvene, okay? All right, guys, first class down. One more to teach while I'm out of breath. <sighs> one more to teach, one to take. Feeling good. Gotta go do my cardio right now, so. 60 minutes on the stairs, girls. Let's fucking get it. Alrighty, guys and gals, I just did some cardio. I know I look naked with this top on, especially because I'm really not tan. I'm gonna practice a little bit of posing because I've been meaning to for a while now. And my biggest thing this year is that I just want to be super, super confident in my posing. So I am going to record a little posing practice only for like probably 10 minutes or so, but that's better than nothing. phone right now guys the phone cam but i'm going down right now to take Lacey's pilates class 10 a.m on wednesdays i love to take her pilates because it's such a great compliment to strength training also my little tea that i made feeling very valentine's -y. i'm always feeling valentine's because pink is my favorite color and alex is working out so let me show you him. <laughs> He's being extra nice today because it's Valentine's Day. We'll take it. All right, girls. I've barely vlogged today and I'm like, I'm going to vlog all Valentine's Day. 12 well, hours later. <laughs> here we are. Basically, I've just been working, working day in and day out. Been here since 6 a.m. It's now almost 4 p.m. It's freaking snowing out, but it's also 40 degrees. So what What do you have to say about that, God? This is how they start the apocalypse. It's like an episode of Black Mirror. We're about to go to a can event at Four Seasons. And so we'll catch you there, okay? Can we catch you there? Yes. Yes, girl. Come on now, give us
I mean, it's a Fritz Bernays. <laughs> Oh, it's Kelly knows the Oni. <laughs> okay, I have to go through the goodie bag with you guys later because it's crazy. But we got a ton of can. I'm giving basically it all to Noah because he deserves it. And he's getting some poppies, some mango chutney, and this dough cookie dough. I bet Jordan will like this. Oh, yeah, and the Sunnies. And what's your Valentine's Day wish, girl? Give it to us straight. I need that fire D tonight. You <laughs> gonna put it down. <laughs> I also got this in my goodie bag, and I'm giving that to Noah because I'm really just gearing up for pop. No, I've eaten a bajillion of these freaking Kodiak cake protein balls today. What do you have to say? I'm about to gobble this last one down the hatch. Gobble me, swallow me, girl. <laughs> and then we gonna clear this spin class. Yeah, clear. Clear. <laughs> no, show me what you're drinking, girl. Gorilla Mind. Can really you give us a little call. ASMR? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I know I was gonna ask you if you wanted me to bring them down he got Valentine's there's a Cartier ring in each one by the mm -hmm. way mm-hmm the Fritz Bernay <laughs> I don't know if I said this you guys but good thing I brought this wagon so went to the can event it was at Four Seasons I will show you the whole goodie bag after it was Legitimately the cutest event I've ever seen in my entire life. It was so flipping cute um, And I have a whole bunch of just junk on my desk it appears, but I'm about to take Noah's spin class um, And then go home probably get home around like seven, but the biggest miracle I'm still hanging on to this being the biggest miracle and that's the fact that my camera is the right way now My Valentine's station still going strong honestly it looks like most of the bracelet stuff has gotten used up and the Valentine stuff has gotten like completely used. So I'm hyped about that because I did not want that to go to waste. And now here we are going to Spinnerific. Let's see what we got going on in here. These balloons have been hanging on for their dear life. It is snowy you guys the snow was starting to stick my wagon shit got snow in it um, but also I just pulled the wagon in and Hope my apartment is not watching. Thea, no, I'm gonna go through that bag in a minute. All right, y'all, let's dive into this goodie bag. I'm on the floor of my bathroom because the lighting is best in here and it's already dark out. But this is a massive, heavy bag full of goodies. So I can't wait to show you what's all in. First thing is from this brand called Noon. Noon nootropic CBD drops are made with natural plant-based ingredients and organically grown hemp. Okay, the bottle is super cute. It's kind of coming out. Some CBD drops. Shake well. Recommended to add to drinks or take directly. Start with half a dropper and adjust as desired. So cutie. We love all the CBD and THC. Honestly, like I feel it helps with my recovery so much. And you know, I'm not really a big drinker. And we've got a full little bag of this skincare. This brand is called Good Molecules. I feel like I've heard of this. Also, this bag is adorable. And there's literally a full size product of everything cleanser, daily moisturizer. This is good because I actually did need more moisturizer. Niacinamide brightening toner. And hyaluronic acid serum and pimple patches so i will keep you in um 
in the loop of how I like this brand. I'm so hyped to try it. I am so grateful my friend Destiny who works for Can invited me to this event because literally it was so freaking cute. I'm so proud of her, but so hyped about trying those. Then we've got a little Can bandana wrapping something handle easy dose it slash easy does it you know but dose for microdose mmm smells so yummy from excelsior candle company which excelsior is a place in minnesota so the flavor is mango pineapple it smells insane then we have something from a brand called athena club i think Let's see, Better Made Simple, and it is, ooh, a cutie little pink razor. That's amazing because I need to get rid of mine. There's a brand called Yuki Yohi, Manifest Tools, Art, Ideas, and Unexpected Collabs from a small design studio in Minnetonka, Minnesota. Super cute, just a little match um, set with a booklet, but that is super cute. I'll have to check out that place. Chomps was also one of the partners. Chomps are ride or dies. Love them. Take them to snack on all the time. Some can, of course. I gave Noah a bunch of the can because he also loves it. Um, Ingrown bikini patch extracts and fades dark spots from a brand called Fazit. Oh, here's another thing from the brand Yuki Yohi diffuse candle egyptian mint and eucalyptus yum i was just gonna hold it up to you to smell it but it smells like mint and eucalyptus which i love that it's just like a clean refreshing scent i have wanted to try this brand i just told noah um i've seen people use this as like I don't know they put it on even under their makeup and it's spf 30 this is perfect sunscreen mousse um because i am going to hawaii lie sorry lila was barking but yeah i'm going to hawaii at the end of march i literally cannot freaking wait um and i've seen that brand on instagram before there's this book called the scout guide minneapolis minnesota the Scout Guide is a locally owned national brand dedicated to supporting small businesses in cities from coast to coast. So if you open it up, there's a bunch of Minnesota small businesses. That is so, so, or Minneapolis small businesses. That's so cute. Then we have some honey sticks, bear honey sticks. We've got a package of little elements from the brand LMNT. I love these electrolytes. I love the Lifetime Hydrate electrolytes, but these are probably my favorite after that. So definitely going to pack these. I did get a pack of these that are like chocolate flavored in the mail, and I did not really like them. But these are just like the normal flavors. Mango chili. I love that flavor. Keelan hates that flavor. Grapefruit salt. Slay. I love these. I love something salty. Then we have a... Um, oven mitt from the company the pizza cupcake we have a vegan and gluten-free chocolate pancake and waffle mix you know how much i love pancakes so hyped about this this is actually a local business or started here i didn't realize that but it's a massive massive company now so this is called coconut whisk they have a storefront in minneapolis here um where you can get like waffles and stuff there which is also chef's kiss but you know i love pancakes we'll put this to use i've got a little ooh fizzy thc um dissolvable beverage tablets that's pretty cool this alex is gonna be hyped about this this brand graza i've been seeing everywhere so cute i've wanted to try this olive oil um getting good olive oil is important especially if you cook with it a lot like i do then we've got another little envelope with a secret note we've got a sparkling mango tango energy drink with benefits so it has 150 milligrams green tea caffeine no sugar l-theanine biotin b6 and b12 
will try that tomorrow. Oh, a little cutie pair of earrings from Larissa Loden, you guys. They say fuck. That is cute as fuck. Little packet from the Face Foundry. There's a lippy in there. There's a little brush for face masks. There's a cleanser, and I'm assuming a face mask in here. I've been there for some facial services before, and I love it. It's also super close to me. I need to lean back on this because my back was hurting. A little lube from the brand Wisp. More can, duh. Guys, I waited to save this till last because it's the cutest. It is a bong candle. Like, so cute. The flavor is tangerine dream. We love. Oh, also this pack of from Mary and Jane of Sunny. Their little one um, milligram microdoses of THC. Mushroom chocolates for arousal and pleasure. Ooh, I've seen this brand on Instagram before. Dose is one square. Then there's something in here. Hot sauce with a twist. Smoky hot. And I think that is everything. So cute. Thank you, Can, and thank you, Destiny, for inviting me. That was the perfect Valentine's event. So freaking cute. Um, I'm going to set this up so I can take a little photo of it. And then I'm going to start cooking dinner slash shower. I'm showered. Dinner is quite literally done. Um, I have a grapefruit element in here. And it is beyond. Beyond. Okay, and here is dinner. It's literally just a steak taco. We had the same thing last night. But... We're doing our, like, just us Valentine's Day um, on Sunday. So, not cute right now, but that's okay. As opposed to the one where we brought a friend last week. Yeah. The us and friend Valentine's Day. Well, it's cute. It's not the same. Okay, I am making a chocolate peanut butter protein lava cake. I need to get the recipe up. But I'm going to show you the protein that I'm going to use. The recipe is from Erin Lives Whole. And of course, you literally have to scroll to the bottom to get the ingredients. But it's oat flour, protein powder, cocoa powder, coconut sugar. I literally just used um, stevia, like a packet of it. Baking powder, almond milk, and chocolate chips. I don't have chocolate chips, so I'm not going to do that. For a third of the flour that I'm putting in, I'm doing this sweet lupin flour. I like it. It, I mean, it doesn't really taste like anything. Um, its macros are pretty good, better than obviously regular flour. Um, and so I do like two thirds regular flour, one third of this. All right guys, I know it's not <clears throat> Valentine's Day anymore, obviously. Well, not obviously, I guess, if you're watching it. Well, yeah, obviously. It's too early. It's not that early, but I had to get up and teach early this morning. But I'm going to end this vlog because it was a little Valentine's vlog for y'all. I hope you liked it. My next vlog is going to be really, um, I would say, like, fitness-oriented. I'm going to take you to the gym with me. Um, but... I hope that you liked this video. I will talk to you soon. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you later. Bye.